In the Juniper on Juniper design, we have WAN core and then WAN edge. We call this point a Juniper point of present, a JPOP. One of the most important things when you do a large architecture like this is to have designs that are repeatable. Our JPOPs are standardized across the globe. They all look virtually identical. Those JPOPs are the aggregation points for many core services, not just the network, also the security, but importantly in our design to enable cloud-to-cloud -cloud management, naming services, DNS obviously, things like Active Directory. They're also a natural point for putting real-time services like voice and video, which we've implemented along with Microsoft products. When we look into the requirement from business on the WAN white area network, we're considering the scalability, reliability, and also how Juniper runs the business. So this is all around satisfied business requirements. Like any customer, we have limitations. And so uh, we try to build our networks in a way that our customer would build the networks. In the implementation of the Juniper on Juniper WAN, we took a reference design on our security egress points, providing a classical firewall. Uh, we use our own products, SRX, for inline IDP. And most importantly, we've added to that stack through partner products for additional monitoring, logging, and security features.